Shorts are really easy and quick to shoot on a tabletop. In this tutorial, I will show you a few different styling techniques to make them look really great online. I have two different shorts with me here today. One pair of men's swimming shorts and one pair of men's um, slightly smarter chino shorts. I'm going to start with the chinos. The first thing I will do is to make sure the hemline is straight. To make the shorts a little bit slimmer, I will tuck in the outside of the shorts just a little bit, just to give them a really nice natural shape. The tricky things with short is the crotch area. There's different techniques as to how you can choose to style the crotch area. I think in this case, with the shorts, it's nicer just to overlap it. So if you tuck the crotch area up a little bit and then you just overlap it with the insides of, from each side. And that gives you a really nice clean line. Then make sure the gap between the legs uh, is not too wide. You want to have a bit of a gap as it naturally would be on your body but you don't want it to be too big. And then make sure the bottom of the shorts, both the insides line up and the outsides line up. And of course, make sure your buttons are done up and your zip is done up as well. There's also some other alternatives um, to keep in mind when you're styling a pair of shorts. Some people like to have the uh, button and zip open. If you do this, make sure the angle is straight on the open bit. Sometimes it doesn't want to stay down and it might be useful to just Pop a little pin in there to keep it down in place. This I think works best if there's an interesting lining on the shorts or if there's any detail you want to show on the inside. Another technique that can be quite useful is to use a bit of tissue paper to stuff the shorts to give it a little bit more volume and that kind of 3D effect. I folded some tissue paper. I'm gonna pop some into the legs. I also want to place some along the hemline. Once you put the tissue paper in, you style them. Then if you want to add even more texture than just the tissue paper, you can go ahead and very gently just scrunch the fabric together a little bit. It would just give it a little bit of movement. You might have to change the light to really bring out those textures. So I'm going to go ahead and move the light to my upper left corner. I think that looks really nice and you can really see those movements in the shorts. So for our next pair, I have this pair of men's swimming shorts. You will style these exactly the way you did with the chinos, by tucking the sides in, making sure the hemline is level and showing a little bit of gap in between the inner thighs. These swimming shorts also have um, these drawstrings on them. You can choose to style the drawstring in many different ways. Um, you can do it in a bow or just have it straight down or style it with a slight curve to it. I think since these are a pair of men's shorts, we can do something with a little bit of movement to it. So I think for these ones, I'm going to go ahead and just do a simple knot. Then I'm going to give them a little bit of a shape by curving them. Paying attention to the small details like this, it's really what makes your products stand out online. So just take your time, place them really neatly and once you're happy with it, you go ahead and take a picture. As you can see, there's many different techniques that you can use when styling shorts. Use the techniques I've shown you here today and really pay attention to those details and all your shorts will look great online.